What if I told you, you could prove to a Muslim that God is triune simply by asking questions? Would you finish watching the rest of this video? I hope you will. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to establish in the Muslim's mind how God is triune. Then we're going to confirm in the second video, and then we're going to summarize in the third video. But in today's video, I'm going to show you how to start establishing in the Muslim's mind that God the Father is alive, that God's Spirit is eternal, that God's Word is eternal. Now here's where you start asking the questions with the Muslim. And the first question is, do you believe God is alive? And just listen to him respond. Then you ask, do you believe God's Spirit is eternal? And then the last question I want you to ask is, do you believe God's Word? Is it created or eternal? Now, with these three questions, you're going to begin to establish in the Muslim's mind that the Father is eternal, God's Spirit is eternal, and God's Word is eternal. And we all know who the Word is. John 1.1, 1, 1, the Word was with God and the Word was God, referencing Jesus Christ. But you don't have to tell the Muslim all of that at this time. Just begin using those three questions until the next video comes out, probably next week. All right, remember, we're going to believe, confirm, and summarize in the Muslim's mind and their hearts that God is triune, starting with, is God alive? Do you believe God's Spirit is eternal? And do you believe God's Word is created or eternal? See you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like this video. Talk to you next time.